So I've got these two pieces of sheet metal that are work hardened. They've already been work hardened once and then I annealed them with a torch to get them soft again. And then I've bent on them again a little bit more and everything and added some texture to the faces and stuff like that for the finished sculpture that they're going to be. And they are work hardened again. So they, when you tink on them, it's a really tinny sound. And it, if I continue to bang on it without doing this process, it will actually tear the metal because I'll bend it too much. What annealing does is it resets the metal to its softest original state. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to get these pieces of metal. Well, this is a two-fold project, actually. I'm burning off all the guts and the contents for this fire pit. I just made the vent holes and everything. I'm going to do more work because it's a commission job. It's bent angle iron wrap around the top with holes in it and everything. It's going to end up looking really cool, but there's a little pyramid down there, actually. Um, when you first start the fire, all the wood stacks on top of it and the paper material sits down underneath there and everything. And as you can see, and I didn't work hard at this fire at all, um, but it's a roaring fire. I used an entire trash can worth of scrap 2x4, 2x6, and 4x4 to get this coal bed and everything. So this is a project that I need to burn the coating off to actually do more cutting and everything. And then I needed to anneal these and I was going to use the torch, but then I was like, oh man, this is perfect. I can actually just do it like this. So what I'm going to do, now that it's down to a decent temperature, super hot in there though. Drop that in there like that. Drop that in there like that. And then I got the cover right over here. Let me see if I can do this one hand. Look out piles of danger. And I'm going to cover the entire thing up. And I'm going to let all those coals and all those embers burn super slow. And everything's going to burn down. That was the original color of the actual barrel itself before it got burned down. And this is with it with all the lining removed and everything. So there's a lot more cutting that is involved with the plasma torch and stuff like that for this to be a finished project. But I am going to be able to do the pieces of sheet metal in there and get them annealed for more bending for another art project that I'm doing. So cool. Two birds with one stone. Thanks for watching. Duck Roll Designs.